me trying to make this twist out last. Hi, and welcome back to Achieving Be With Taryn. I'm Taryn. Hey, yeah. Okay, y'all. So first of all, I made this sweater myself. Okay, don't, you saw the stitching. Don't look at the stitching. But like, I crocheted this, I'm trying to make it so you don't see the stitching. I crocheted this whole thing by myself. I'm so proud of me. It took me a couple weeks because I would like stop and start, stop and start. But it turned out so good. Can you see all the colors? It's so pretty. I might not do a full face today because my goal is the eyes. You know what I mean? And you've seen how to put on foundation, concealer, and bronzer. We all know, okay? And blush and highlighter, you know this. If you don't, go back to my other videos. I don't have any new foundations or anything to try out today, so I probably will skip the face portion and just focus on my eyes, because that's why we're here. My goal today is to give you a very fun and flirty Valentine's Day eye look. Okay, even if you don't have a valentine, I'll be your valentine. And if you don't have a you don't need a valentine to be cute, okay? A valentine does not equal validation, okay? So we just gonna get cute for the overall holiday, all right? If you have not already, please like this video, share it, and subscribe to this channel, okay? Tell your friends, tell your mama, because 2021 finna be what? our year all right there you go if you are new here welcome to chibi beat if you are not welcome back i missed you how was your week we are gonna get into this eye look let me do my eyebrows and then i'm gonna prime my lids and then i'm gonna zoom in i'll be back in a minute all right i have done my brows i have <laughs> primed my eyelids i look great I even zoomed in. So just like a heads up, I'm having a very gnarly breakout because I've been eating sugar like a crazy person and my face and sugar hate each other. And I haven't been washing my face. It's just been like a lot. But you know, if you see a little breakout, you don't. Okay, so <laughs> for our Valentine's Day, I, of course, I'm sticking with the pinks and the reds. I'm very basic. Might throw a little purple in there. I'm not sure yet. So the first color we're gonna use is this really pretty neon pink that I love. So it's in the Pro, uh, Pro Fusions Pro Pigment Palette. This is me covering up the clearance sign. So I love this palette so much. It was like, it was 341, <laughs> if anybody's interested. Um, so yes, I'm gonna use this palette. The first color we're gonna go in with is called, ooh, is Jive, which is that really cute, like hot pink moment. Um, and that is going to be our outer lid color, but we're kind of just gonna put it everywhere, like go crazy, like all the way out here. If you are doing this look and you are like doing a whole face, put your foundation on first, okay? I probably should have said that. <laughs> don't stop what you're doing put your foundation on okay because this will literally go all over it again i'm not putting foundation on today but i wanted to do a very pretty valentine's day look i'm putting it all in my brow like look at that pimple my breakout has gone into my eyebrow this shadow is so pigmented like i only dipped in like a couple times and like I dipped it maybe like three times and this is what we came up with don't sleep just cuz it's cheap guys we established that model in our last video I'm taking it down below my lower lid as well this would stick so much better it might look a little better with like foundation and concealer but not doing that today. Oh yeah. I'm just gonna buff out my ends a little bit just so it doesn't look like a like triangle on my face, you know? Just like so like that, like Auntie Tab would say. Like so like that. My mustache is like, hi, how are ya? She didn't cover me up today. <laughs> I didn't, I did not cover my mustache today. I mean, listen, we look great. We look great right now. Do we have to keep going? You know what I mean? Okay, so the next color we're gonna use is another Profusions 
palette. My face is just so affordable. I love that little stuff. So this is the mini rubies palette. I've used it numerous times on my channel and we're gonna go in with that red. I'm starting to think one is just satiny and one isn't. I don't know, but we're gonna go in with this one. Cause doesn't that, that looks like satiny, right? We're, we're doing that one, but that, anyway, that's the one we're doing. All right, and I'm gonna take that right inside of our pink. I would be lying if I said I had a ton of brushes to use right now because they're all dirty. <laughs> like all my brushes are filthy and waiting to be washed. Which is why I'm relying so heavily on my brush cleaner today. And I'm taking that up into my brow as well. Gorge! This is gorge. If this is not your cup of tea, I understand. Keep it, you know, tight, keep it cute. I don't know, I'm feeling like ethereal today. So we're just, we're just kind of going everywhere. We're going just about everywhere on our eye. And I'm starting to love this type of eye look lately. I don't know what it's called, honestly. I see it all over TikTok and I know it's like, the soft aesthetic, but I don't know if this eye look has a name. Like when you just kind of put it on everywhere around your eye. I love it though. Say what you want, these colors together, very Valentine's Day. <laughs> All right, I think I'm going to do what we did last week with our little make a cream shadow hack. Cause I know I was obsessed. Like I was super obsessed. So I had this neon pigment from Glamier, um, the bubble gum color, which I've used before, but I'm gonna try mixing that with a little P. Louise base and seeing what happens. So it made this really pretty pink. Can you see it? It's a very pretty, like, it made a really pretty, like light pink color. So that is going to be, let's see what, let's just see what happens. I don't really have a plan. That is gorgeous. Can you see? It's like pink, my camera's like freaking out. Like you're doing too much. Oh gosh. I wonder if I can make a heart. Do you have faith in me? Do you have faith in me? I can make a heart. I don't have faith in, oh, I'm not a very, me and confidence, we have issues. Oh God. Nope, it, it's not happening. It is not happening. So we are just going to, I'm gonna soften the edges with some eyeshadow. So don't worry too much about your margins. Focus on the shape we are creating and making sure it's not patchy. So I'm gonna bring the red back in and kind of clean up that line with a little bit of soft, fluffy shadow. But for now, I'm gonna do this eye because I am incredibly obsessed with the results. Of course, I took this one all the way up here in the... Okay, now I gotta go all the way up there with this one. Okay, guys, if the edges of this shape are bothering you, don't worry, we're gonna clean it up now. <laughs> so I'm going back in with that red from our Profusions palette, and I'm going to use that and kind of buff these lines out a little bit. And I'm just literally taking it directly onto the pink color we made and diffusing it with little circles. Little baby circles. Like that. So classy, so angelic. Same with up above. This one was really, I'm sure, bothering some people like, <laughs> Uh, excuse me, <laughs> you got a weird shape up there. Like, I got you, I got you. Don't worry about it. We buffed it out, she's gone. You can breathe. Same with the other side. Just wanna make sure they even. Cause we know me. We know how I roll. <laughs> they will be uneven as heck. 
because I have the I have the hardest time doing something on one eye as a, like the same as I do on the other eye. That it troubles me. Now I feel like like in here is like missing something. You know what I mean? Like it just looks a little like empty, but I don't necessarily want to do the red. So I have this little elf palette that I bought from the Dollar Tree the other day. If you follow me on Instagram, you saw me like excited about it on my stories. It's the Peach Squad little duo and this gold is so pretty. I'm gonna use this little peach color. We're gonna see if that kinda, I don't know. I'm gonna put that in here. Oh, that's nice. It's like a little neutral reprieve from all the chaotic, you know, shadow, but it's still very pretty, still pink. Oh yeah, that's cute. And it blends everything out so well. It's harder to see because A, I don't have on foundation and B, it's kind of close to my skin tone, but it is very pretty and pink. Well, actually, peach, of course, because it's called Peach Squad, so that makes sense. And we're gonna use that to... I'm gonna use that to camouflage the rest of our cut crease, but also as our last color to kind of blend everybody together. For our lower lash line, I'm using that same neon pigment in the color Bubblegum from Glammy Air that we use to mix um, with concealer to make a little cream shadow. I'm gonna put that across the bottom lid. I'm gonna do it all the way across because we have the rest of it kind of hanging out down there. But I think I'm still gonna bring a little more red into it because it's very pink and I wanted a little more red. What the heck? Solid. Solid as a rock. Ooh. Right now I love you. If you don't have a Valentine's, it's Valentine's Day. I'm not gonna like belittle your feelings by going like, so what? Because I understand like, that could like really stress people out. They feel so alone. How are these holidays? Holidays are tough because they like, they literally make you feel like you're missing out. You feel alone, so. I'm not gonna say like tough, you know what I mean? Cause I hate when people do that. But I will say, I say but like I'm gonna negate everything I'm saying now. But I will say, Valentine's Day is a man-made holiday, okay? The goal is forever and always to be loved, 365. So if you do not have a Valentine, it's okay. Focus on getting the love that you want to receive. And that does not mean having a Valentine all the time, you know? Focus on really finding somebody that will love you the way you need to be loved and that, you know, their, your communication styles match up. It's like, it, it's not always about pomp and circumstance. It's about the quality of it. You know what I mean? All right, so I'm gonna go beneath that pink with that same red. Just a little bit, just a, just a little bit as she fills in everywhere. But we've already took it, taken it low on the face, so who really cares? I saw this girl on TikTok do like makeup on her eye bags, and I feel like that's what I'm like doing right now. I look like a crazy, <laughs> a crazy Valentine sleep deprived thing. I feel great. I feel like I look great. <laughs> so I'm just going to take a clean brush and kind of buff out the shadow on my face just so it doesn't look like it has any clean lines, but more like fluffy and loosey-goosey, you know? Now we're gonna do some eyeliner. Little eyeliner. I'm using the Glamier Pastel Liners in the color Sugar Cane, which is like a very pretty pastel. No, my refrigerator won't let me be great. It's a very pretty pastel pink. No, this video is not sponsored by Glamier, by the way. <laughs> I just use a lot of their liners. My videos are never sponsored. I don't get enough views for anybody to care that much about me. <laughs> it's 
so trust and believe there is no sponsors or ads in any of my videos thus far so this is a water activated liner so I just I actually put this little angle brush in water and then I put it in the liner but I guess you can also like spray it so it just it just activate activates with water like that and we're gonna line our lid Alright, in efforts to clean this up, I do not have a good liner brush, guys. This is just getting worse and worse. So we're going to pretend that these wings did not get out of hand. <laughs> this is the wing that we've come up with. <laughs> oh, it is a lot. It is a lot of wing. Um, was not my intention. So <laughs> I'm gonna put mascara on my bottom lashes and this is the Maybelline New York Snap Scara in the color, oh my gosh, I don't have glasses on. Dark Cherry, looks like this. I got it from the Dollar Tree. Um, it is kind of reddish, but all in all, it shows up brown mostly. I'm just gonna put that on the bottom lashes another Ioni lashes day and today we're using the wispy dramatic lashes which look like this so for pretty I don't know you better sponsor me because I don't really use any other lashes brands I'm gonna venture out though I'm, I'm just gluing my lashes but I'm gonna venture out though and try to use more lashes brands um but these are just so good and they're at the Dollar Tree for one dollar. That's very hard to beat in my opinion. <laughs> Please comment down below and tell me your favorite affordable lashes so that, you know, put me on game so that I can scoop them. Um, because I tend to just wear like these or like Ardell lashes. I've never tried the like Eyelore, what is it, Eyelore London ones? They just seem to like, not fancy, expensive. They can be like really expensive. And I'm like, baby girl, this is Walgreens. I don't know if I got like that kind of money for a lash. I'm gonna put a little bit of mascara on my inner lashes because I don't plan on putting my lashes there. And this is just the L'Oreal Voluminous um, Mascara, which is my all time favorite mascara. I got those lashes on. Yeah, they tried to kill me. These lashes tried to kill me, especially because I don't be doing the most because to be honest, I glue my lashes on and then I just take them off immediately <laughs> um, because I'm just filming in my house. So it really doesn't make like a big difference. Um, but yeah, that was a doozy. So now that our eyes are done, let's zoom out and let's disguise. And that's gonna do it for today's video, guys. How do we feel about our eye look? Do we love? I love it. I think it is so friggin' pretty and like avant-garde and like, you know, like soft and, and I don't know. I don't know, I just love it. And I just love this whole trend of just doing eye makeup just kind of everywhere, you know what I mean? So I'm here for it, we stand. I put a little lip gloss on because I felt like I needed a little something else. It just felt really, uneven now i kind of wish i did a full face because it would be like everything but i plan on doing this whole like loose eyeshadow thing more often i don't know it's just ugh, it's so me you know <laughs> yeah so like i said before please like share and subscribe i want you to know when i upload and i want you to be a part of the cheapy beat family okay we're trying to grow so i need you i uh, look at me and look at my beautiful Valentine's Day eyes. I need you. Okay, that's all I'm gonna say. You know you wanna just do it. Just just go ahead and click the subscribe button. Just just click it. I'll wait. Did you do it? I'm so proud of you. Thank you. Uh, 
have me and my sweater. <laughs> me and my sweater that I made. Y'all, I'm so obsessed with this sweater. But anyway, we thank you so much for being here. I love you. Goodbye. This is the best time for a heart because it's Valentine's Day. Can we, can we get into... Okay, wait a minute. Do my finger hearts. Do my finger hearts. In my homemade sweater. Do my finger hearts. And if nobody tells you happy Valentine's Day and that they love you, I love you. Okay? I do. I really do. I really do. So happy Valentine's Day. Goodbye. <laughs>